behind me is Douglas hyphen fir. So this is not a true fir. It's in the family Pinaceae, and the genus is Pseudotsuga, and Zizii is the specific epithet. So the species is Pseudotsuga and Zizii. Pseudo means false, and Tsuga means it's a Japanese word for hemlock. So this is also a false hemlock. Not a true fir, false hemlock, also not a spruce. It's, it's in its own genus for a very good reason. Now, this can be easily mistaken from a distance for a spruce or a fir, but if we look at uh, the features more closely, we'll see how it's easy to distinguish. Here we have a cone. If you can see that, it's got cone scales similar to what we would see in spruce, and its cone does hang down, but it has these little bracts that come off. And that really distinguishes it from the spruce and certainly the fir. Remember, fir only have a cone that sticks up off and is deciduous. These would hang down, similar to what we see with spruce cones, but they have these little bracts to help us. Let's take a closer look at the needles as well. In the spring, we can see, spring and summer, we have a lighter color. These will darken up. That's the newest growth. If we look closely at the twig, we can see that it doesn't have a suction cup that we might expect to see on the fur, but they are singly attached in a slightly different manner than either the fir or the spruce. The needles are flat, but they come to a little bit of a point. At the end, what we would see is a nice pointed bud with imbricate scales. The bark is fairly similar to spruce or fir having kind of a scaly plate. This is the form view for Douglas fir. Notice that it is also X current, meaning at the top we see small branches slowly widening as we get to the base of the tree.